Hey everybody, Phil here again from Japan, this time inside. It's quite windy day outside, so I thought, uh, no point in me recording outside. Didn't even go that well yesterday. Anyway, I'm here because, not because I'm an expert or whatever, but yesterday I made this video about how in Japan things are, seem to be a little bit different in this COVID-19 coronavirus crisis, and why was that and how confused I was, you know, that we're not seeing the same kind of craziness, for want of a better word, that we're seeing in um, other countries. And what, so, you know, my friends uh, on the internet um, came up with some resources that I think are really interesting. And it comes down to, first of all, the uh, why isn't it spreading in these cases that oh, I thought it should spread, you know, like uh, on the trains where they pack in like sardines and all the rest of that stuff. And that's because of this uh, great Venn diagram that maybe I'll put in the video, I don't know, that talks about the intersection and the three requirements of an uh, incredible outbreak. And that is, you know, first of all, a closed space, which of course a train is a closed space. Many people, and of course on a train there's many people, but the third most important thing is this close contact communication, and that is people talking to each other in a very close setting or touching each other or whatever like that, and that just doesn't happen on the train here in Japan. If you've ever been on the train here in Japan, you know that everybody if, if they are sitting down, they're looking at their phone, they never talk to anybody else. People don't talk. It's one of the freaky things about taking the train in Japan is how silent it is, you know? So people are not talking to each other in general. And the people who are standing are standing and they are not talking to anyone and they're probably standing and doing, you know, like looking at the phone and holding on the thing with one or, you know, whatever. So this... Uh, what they call short distance conversation, that's not happening on the train. And maybe that's why the virus is not spreading uh, on the trains, for example. So perhaps that answers my question about why that's not happening. I hope that's true because I'm going to take a train on Saturday. And, um, and then so my other question, my, the other thing that came out, you know, is that in Japan, they are doing a different kind of containment than it seems to be being done in the rest of the world. And I'm going to zip back up because I've got this document over here. And that is that, you know, they're doing uh, cluster measures. And so they find the person or people who are infected and lock down everything around them. You know, so we're not doing this global or, you know, national lockdown or anything like that. And so this person, uh, this paper that I got, cites some uh, research about this. And, um, and basically it comes down to that, like I mentioned yesterday, where 50% of cases in North Korea seem to be tied to one person, one person can infect causally a large number of people. And that's kind of what makes this virus special. So the Japanese approach, as we saw with uh, the cruise ship, is to lock people down. If you've got it, you're locked down. And this being uh, Japan, I was going to say Asia, but I don't really know about the rest of Asia, but this being Japan, you do what you're told. And that seems to have worked for them so far. You know, like right now, there's not a massive number of cases, I'm just going to see if I can um, take a look. We've got uh, 1,128 cases here in a country of 120 million people. So it is not rampant here. So that's maybe the answers to some of those questions that I had yesterday about what's different and why it's not spreading and all the rest of that stuff. Now, all that being said, uh, it's possible that this cluster, cluster measure will only work in a small, when you have a low rate of infection.
So I think I think things are going to change here, and I think we're eventually going to see the more stringent measures like we see in other countries. Perhaps we'll see. Uh, okay, that's all for today. Talk to you soon if I have anything to talk to myself about. Bye.